Don't forget to pack these on your beach vacation. Welcome back to Foodie Adventures. These are the top 10 things you must have on any beach vacation, going to Hawaii, etc. We have number one, the packable day pack right here. You wanna have this to carry all your necessities around. You know, it's not the biggest bag, but it's packable and foldable. We put all our uh, food and stuff in the small compartment and you know, all of our other necessities in the bigger compartment. Number two, we have the Bucky's insulated bag keeps things cold you know maybe put a little block of dry ice in there or just regular ice uh, have our little drink on whenever number three so we have the water bottle holder you can take this on your hike and be hands-free and have some cold water you know this is going to keep it uh insulated number four is going to be the uh, packed up towels over here all rolled up nicely and neatly and very compact I can hang these on my cargo shorts. I got a little carabiner. Hang it. We like to use these because we don't want to bring those big bulky hotel towels around. And number five. You got your trusty hat. Keep your face out of the sun. We got the back being mesh, making it a lot cooler for you. Sure, this you dries faster if you get it wet. It's definitely a plus. Sunglasses is number six. Somebody has good taste, right? Keep those eyes protected. And number seven, we have my favorite, the coconut oil. You can use it for sun protection. It's better than using one of those toxic uh, sunscreens. And number eight, we have the bug repellent oil. That's gonna be the herbal insect body oil, if you can see that. It actually works really good, so we're gonna take that on the trip with us. So number nine is the emergency poncho. You can find these for like 99 cents. It'll really save your ass if you don't wanna get wet. Especially if you're hiking and you have nowhere to run to and you just need to get something to cover your body so you don't get all your you know good clothes wet. And number 10, waterproof phone pouches so you can take wonderful pictures, under the sea with you and me. This works great. Hopefully I can remember to use it on my trip. It keeps the phone dry, you know, when you're trying to get that one little shot underwater. And it keeps the sand off your phone, that pesky sand. You don't want that sand to get into your you know, phone at all. Uh, I'm gonna throw in a bonus over here. My fanny pack. Picked this up for like 19, 20 bucks, a little Jan Sport there. And it comes in hand if you actually need more than just cargo pants for some reason. You know, see all this stuff is kind of nerdy and it kind of hooks together. Those are some things that are gonna definitely help you on your beach trip. I hope you've learned something and stay tuned. Foodie Adventures might be doing a tour near you. Thank you for tuning in. Please comment, like, and subscribe and hit the notification bell.